Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Void Tyrant number two with me, Jelanon, iOS. And by number two, I mean episode number. Yeah, I should, I should probably qualify that. I did end up buying all the spirits. I looked at the app store to figure things out. Uh, basically, there are three spirits you could buy. They're three or two ninety nine each before you buy the pack. So you basically save four dollars if you buy the pack. Now, additionally, they also double rewards and things. So that should make the game faster for people who are interested in that. And it looks like the only other purchase is a Warp Rift, which I have no idea what that is, for 99 cents. So the Spirits and the Warp Rift. So overall, yeah. Ooh. Effect played twice. Uh, let's take it, just because. Blessing of Anput. Effectiveness of any enemy healing or regeneration is halved. Okay. That's cool. Um, anyway, so yeah, we probably would have gotten just 28 goldens there before, interestingly enough. Uh, let's get energy plus 5. I like being able to play cards. Upgrade class card. So kick can be really useful in the right circumstance. Will it show us what the upgrade will be do? Okay, yep. More damage. What about unstoppable fury? Ooh, that's pretty good. Hmm, and that also makes you immune to stuff for three rounds, so that would be good. Shove back. Also pretty good. Suck a punch. Only three extra damage, so that's worse than the kick upgrade. Blood Nebula Strike. Pretty good card, but you need to have strikes in order to make that useful. So Unstoppable Fury is probably the best to upgrade right now. That's my opinion. I don't know. Ooh, Potion and Health Shrines are more effective. Or add two random modifiers to your deck. Um, let's add two random modifiers. What does that do? Okay, won't tell me. Got it. <laughs> Into Squire, exit night. Uh, so I'm going to wait to rate Void Tyrant. Uh, one reason I did buy the pack is because I do want to reward people for good game design, and also, it feels like in this game, it's not so much that they're trying to limit your progress artificially, uh, because you can always watch ads to keep progressing, and, you know, that doesn't take too much time. And, of course, you have the option to turn off all ads. Okay, so, Insectoid Spellcaster's Cold. Undead. Here we go. That's what we want to see. More undead. Because we are the knights that never end. Except for the undead. They're not your friends. Da -da 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 -da. Anyway. Upon boarding the shipwreck, you fear the worst, as there are no sounds coming from within. The interior is mostly undamaged. Some things are out of place. But other than that, it is remarkably clean. Suddenly, the silence is broken as the speaker system crackles. By entering this vessel, you have committed blasphemy against the Church of the Overlord mainframe. The punishment is execution by electrocution. Proceed to the nearest mechanoid to receive your punishment. So, a mainframe with a serious case of hubris, and likely corrupted by an unstable chaos key. I'll bring my sword. All right, then. Okay, it's dangerous to go alone, guys. Hmm. What do I not want here? Don't want you. Call drone. Deep knowledge and curses. It is immune to bleeding, infection, and poison. Electric damage is effective, while dark and holy damage is not. Yeah, I haven't even seen my holy smite pop up. Hmm. I wonder if I should look into that. Oh. Energy shard. So it's going to play cards, probably. One damage bonus for the remainder of the battle. I'm okay with it playing that. As long as it doesn't win. Hmm. Let's do... I don't think it's going to play another card. Otherwise, I would have kicked it. I probably should have kicked it there. Oh, well. Uh, we're going to get a plus one. 
And that is it. Oh, it did play. Oh, my word. It played another thing. Oh, well. At least we take one less strike. Ugh, the damage. Okay, it did get the damage. Sadness is mine. Okay, that's bad. We'll go ahead and play it. Match it. Ah, <sighs> oh, you were missed. Unstoppable fury. Hmm. So hopefully our opponent has used all their good cards now. Damage bonus. Okay. We're definitely kicking here. Ah. Uh, unfortunate. Alright, it sounds like my sound is going a little... Oh my word, okay. Well, Cauldron is showing us we should not take any enemy too lightly. Especially since I'm not getting energy. Hmm. Magic damage increased by three. Not great for us. Okay, they've matched us. I think we're gonna risk it. Okay, that's not great. Hmm, I'm just gonna defend. Wow. Even the boss wasn't this tough. <laughs> And they had crazy cards. Okay, three. Let us... Prepare to attack? No, we'll do the one to three. If we get a three, that would be great. And then we have the chance to do the plus two, which I think we will do. We want to end this combat sooner rather than later. Because we're taking a ton of damage. Okay. Hmm. And we're playing this. Question is, do we want to play Unstoppable Fury? I think the answer to that is no. We'll play this. So we get two axes if we win. Oh dear. We've matched. I didn't play Unstoppable Fury like a noob. Uh, we'll stop here now. Okay. Unstoppable Fury. I upgraded it for a reason, and I should play it. Okay. I'm gonna stand here. Okay. Make equipment cards cost nothing. We'll play this and gain an extra two armor. As far as I can tell. Right. Right. Maybe we get nothing out of that. Hmm. No, well, that's not great. Hmm. We'll risk it. Oh, okay. And I was thinking of playing the axe, and I should have because it was free. But oh well. I just didn't think we'd win. Okay. That round, I should say. Okay. More XP. Let's go to the side room. Ooh, treasure. So we have the Spirit of Treasure, so we get stuff right. Or Spirit of Fortune. Yes, I do want the Spirit of Fortune. I paid money for him. Okay. Moving on. Encounter. What's this? Okay, regenerates. Crawlogram. Does that mean it... Look at things around and copy them. Okay. Know some enchantments. It's got 13 attack, though, huh? Hmm. Pretty significant. Replicate weapon. So... It probably has my axe now. That's not great. Let's do this. And then that. Reset it. Because 10 was a pretty good number. But 
that guy. Oh, man. I think we'll stop here. We got the two strikes because of our shove back card. And it happened twice, so we got four strikes. Pretty good. Remind me what days it is. Ah, okay. We'll play that early. Prevent it from doing stuff. And hopefully, we can win. Would have been nice to gain some health back, but oh well. Uh, let's play this and win, basically. It has a choice. Okay. We win with two, and that should do it. Alright. Since we hit the 12, we also had a critical. Oh, Fencing Sword 2. Hmm. So it's only like one damage more than Fencing Sword 1, as I can tell. Maybe it's less energy? It doesn't seem like it. But no, we do not want you, Fencing Sword 2. Alright. Though it would be a good versatile card. I have nothing against it. We've just we've gone for damage. We've made our choices in life. Okay. Countdown timer minus one. Oh, that looks bad. We do not want it to get more stuff, basically. Um let's try a combo here. Well Yeah, we'll do this. And that. And stand. Hopefully he doesn't get a 5 or anything. Oh! Oh, great. Well, that happened. Okay. Hmm. Well, he's not going to play any more cards. I can clearly do this. And not die. Hopefully he doesn't play his next two countdown things. He's got a lot of armor. So that is bad for us. Uh, let's... Not play Unbalanced yet? Hmm. As long as it's not a three or less. If it's greater than three, basically. Which is half the cards... He would lose. But we're not going to worry about that yet. Okay, so apparently I should have done it. Um, he's not going to play anything else. We'll just try to mitigate damage, I think. Oh, well. We'll play another card. And we'll stop there. Okay. Don't have enough for shove back, so we're gonna do that. Unstoppable Fury will play. There's a reason we have it. I should just play it when I see it, probably. Okay, that's bad for us. I think we'll stand here. Okay, and with four. So yeah, when you go past twelve. It ends the little number of strikes at the previous amount. That's good to know. So we want to KO him, like, immediately. Hmm. What if I want to get rid of anything? No. Okay. We're playing the kick. And we can actually play all the cards. Do that. Okay. Oh! Okay. Biscuit Dough Hands Man. 33% chance of matching. Do we still have Unstoppable Fury? We do. No! Okay. Oh, it always makes you go down to 6. Well, that's good to know. We die. So, good to know what dying looks like in this game. Oh. Only once, eh? Yeah. We'll do that. Okay. I wonder how much damage that crazy thing will do to us soon. 
Uh, get rid of the boots. Oh, okay. How much damage? 42! It didn't seem like coming back to life was really worth it. <laughs> Altar of Zerlut. Goddess of Blacksmiths. Raise armor, offer weapon. Raise armor. Yep. Okay. We definitely need that armor. I need healing. Be most pleasantly greeted. This unit represents the Shimmerbeak Mechanoid Trade Guild. Trade or no. Give me health, please. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, what are we missing? Snow boots. What does that do? Unbalanced resistance. Oh, okay. Hmm. Squire boots. Give us more attack, it looks like. Oh, reduces melee damage. Okay. Now then. Potions. Okay, that's what we need. Buy and use immediately. <laughs> A large potion. Buy and use immediately. Then we're just going to buy this one. Hope we don't need it. Okay. Acolyte sandals. We don't have any magic. But it raises your max energy, too. That's interesting. Fine boots. Okay, reduces range damage. Battle Axe 2. So it only increases our damage by 1. Good to know. Maybe we do need the fencing sword. <laughs> I'm sorry, I looked down on you, fencing sword. Uh, oh well, we're not going to, right now. We are going to this room. Check out the treasure. Okay. Uh, yeah, I want more money. Oh dear. It's alright. Mainframe, corrupted altar. Is this the boss? Yeah, it is. How dare you enter the holy chamber! Only mechanoid worshippers of the mainframe are allowed here. Oh, I like how the chaos key is on the little keyboard. This is not good. My guess is that the chaos key slowly corrupted the ship mechanoid to alter mainframe. Once it went mad, it sabotaged the ship, killed the crew, and set up its own little cult of mechanoids to do its bidding. Words. Silence. Talking to oneself is not allowed in the inner sanctum. You are hereby sentenced to immediate execution. Kindly place yourself on the execution tarp so that you can avoid making a mess with your burning remains. Okay. Rigged outcome. Okay. That's super good. Ten. Okay. Well, that's me. Uh, we do want to heal. That's only with a victory. Uh, let's see where we get first. Okay. Play you. Play that. Pretty sure he's not gonna play any cards. And we need the health. Okay. Hmm. I guess I'll get rid of shove back for now. Okay. Only one card. No. Yeah, fours and up, right? Doubled would be bad for him. I guess we'll take the chance here. Okay, that worked. Alright. Hmm. Unstoppable Fury is pretty good. We'll go ahead and play it. And this way he can't do any janky stuff to us either. Because he's a boss, and I expect it. Oh, that's bad for us. Okay, we don't have any equipment to help. Oh! And that's less bad for us, because of Unstoppable Fury. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Ooh. Let's play the axe. And then this. And he shouldn't be able to affect 
any of our stuff too much. Okay. So we get three, plus the axe. And we finally get a lethal wound. <laughs> but it really doesn't matter. I guess. And I forgot to pay attention to how much stuff. Oh, uh, we'll deal immediate damage. And KO, right? Oh, no, armor. That's right. Well, we did it anyway. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna do a plus one and hope we win. And we'll stand. There we go. Win. There we go. Cobb. Alright, mainframe. You've got a mainframe cord three. It's a melee weapon, which is good for our hero. I'll electrocutes the opponent for two rounds. More damage. Yeah, we're gonna get it. So you have to compare before you can take it. Which is kinda nice. But I would like the option to just take it immediately when I know it's better. Oh. You found a chaos key. Summon the spirit of secrets. You have a lot of eyes. Okay. What do we get? Plus two. That's pretty good. We've liked having that around. Um, I don't think I need the plus one. We've already got a bunch of them, right? Hmm. I'm going to skip you. Every time you land on critical... Uh, that's a perk. So I think we can just take that and it won't matter, right? Okay, level four. Thank goodness. Um, I do want more melee damage. Especially since we keep running into things with armor. Ooh, power surge sounds really good. Hmm, how to strike. If you're holding a shield, the strikes are critical. Huh. Power surge, though. So is that... Hmm... Okay, so there's victory and bust. So high risk, high reward, versus shield bash, which is apparently always good. So we'll do that. Fast learner would be cool. Or damage reduction, resistance to curses. Uh, Unstoppable Fury already prevents that, I think. For the resistance to curses. Hmm. Let's get more XP. That'll let us get more perks faster, right? Yeah, that's the TV. Okay. Where to now? Eglix, apparently. So we'll check out Eglix next time, dear viewer. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.